Falter. Just a quick one now for Folklore Friday. I have been researching for an update on my Mon and on my Clear class this week, this month, as I record this. And you can get that at theirishpaganschool.com. But it has me looking at Einvar, his horse who came across the, the sea and all the rest of it. So anyway, on a bit of a rabbit hole, I was looking for seahorses in Duchess. And I just came across an interesting one, which I'm going to share with you. So we're talking about Enchanted Lake. So this is from Tuborough in East, Tuborough East, sorry, in County Galway. And it is, um, it's talking about a lake in Moat, which is, and I'm actually going to share, hopefully you can see that as well. Um, there is Google Maps is open here and Tubbero East is over here and Moat is down here in County Athlone. So you've got Galway, Roscommon and Athlone. And so like it's a whole county over and it's what is this? A it's like a 56 minute drive. So it's quite a bit away. So the only thing I can think is maybe that this person who they're recording the stories from is maybe from Moat originally. But anyway, they're talking about lakes over in Moat. Um, unless there's a different Moat now, you know, and it's just kind of known. I did look. But if you know anything about the current geography associated with anything that we're talking about here, please comment below and um, let us know. Okay. I'd love to get some information from somebody who's lived in Moat, who knows these lakes or indeed has lived in Tuborough East and knows something that I don't know about the local geography. So Enchanted Lakes, I knew the man who caught a seahorse in Moat Lake, said an old man to me one evening. And I don't care what anyone says, there are mermaids, seahorses, and every other queer animal you could think of in that lake. So, just reading this story now, it's quite possible, as I said, that somebody who was in the collection area was just talking to someone at a fair or in a pub or something one night, and they're talking about Moat Lake, okay? But I'd still love to know, there's a couple of specific lakes mentioned here. So, well, to continue my story, this man was walking alone by the lake, and he saw a lovely little foal that came up, up out of the lake. The man caught him and brought him home. The foal grew up to be a big strong horse and his master taught him to plough and do other work. One evening, after a hard day's work, the man brought his seahorse down to the lake for a drink. The horse started to drink and he drank so much that the lake began to get smaller and smaller until the poor man thought that his horse would soon empty it. So he said to him, that you may never stop. The words were hardly out of his mouth when the horse jumped into the lake and as soon as he'd gone in, the lake filled up again. The horse was never seen again. Now, this is changing then to Anna, or it just says Anna in brackets. So I don't know, is this a different person who's telling a story? But it continues with, two other lakes are connected with moat, at least it is said, by an underground channel. The names of the other lakes are Loch Lorigine, which is a bogland lake and is about three miles from Moat, Brigan Lake, which is about six miles from Moat and three from Loch Lorigine. They are also supposed to be inhabited by seahorses. It is said that one evening many years ago, a few women were washing clothes by Brigan Lake. It continues on the next page. Ooh, not that page. Did I just open the same freaking page? I did. Sorry. Here's me thinking I was ahead of myself. Anyway, they were washing the clothes by the lake, as was the custom then, when all of a sudden a big black shapeless monster came out of the lake. The women became afraid, as you would, and ran for their lives. The animal lay on the shore for a short time and then went back to the lake again. So there you go. Like I said, if you have any information about those lakes around Moat, um, where they would be on a map or anything like that, please do comment below and let us know. Okay, so it's long a full and I will see you 
for Folklore Friday next week. Slán. <laughs>